Hello traders, how are you doing? Today uh, I'm going to show you a new strategy which we use uh, uh, for boom and crash in order to scalp and this strategy we will trade in a dot so you have my main screen uh, indicator window 1 uh, the RSI and indicator window 2 uh, second RSI and how it looks uh, if you want to set up this strategy then uh, uh, if you are in a public group I posted the settings or inputs of each indicator or if you probably want it uh, now you can find this uh, the, uh, the main indicator you, you uh, the main uh, window or the main charity uh, here uh, you can only add uh, one indicator which is a moving average at uh, 13 only when you wanted to realize the crosses the crosses because anytime the that this indicator uh, the price crosses then you can find a new direction like this time you see the price crosses this indicator and this price cross this indicator we have this uh, indicator uh, moving average in the main charity and uh, in indicator window 2 is the RSI uh, and look here the levels of the RSI and it's so simple uh, a method a, a period one uh, apply close a pixel tree and then change the color and add also a moving indicator which period is a 10 shift t1 method uh, linear weight and apply to close pixel uh, also three it's so simple then uh, come in a window uh, indicator window two uh, rsi uh, we should not change anything only we change the color because we we have the same setup of indicator window one and also add uh, uh, Ekumoji, Ekumo, Ekumojo uh, Kingo Hoya, uh, which is uh, Tencent Sin is a 999 all, all period. Then we will do to have the style, uh, the higher, uh, the top one is uh, Tencent Sin and Kijun Sin uh, with the two different colors, and then we will also apply. Uh, the same color of the main charity, uh, the up, uh, up kumu, down kumu, uh, kiju, sa, kiju span, the same color which the main indicate the main charity has. The main charity has a black color, so uh, we have to apply uh, the down and up kumu, and also chiku span with the color. Uh, of the uh, main charity which is black so and then uh, I have to say then and then that is how you are going to do for your setup first if you do this the second thing you need to understand is how to take trades how to take trades okay let me talk about first the uh, a boom okay for example boom 1000 boom 1000 so boom anytime uh, this level is like this uh, RSI uh, indicator window one when the price is on uh, is below uh, 95 and above 80 you can take trades for sell okay for example in here we uh, I, I place 2.5 okay okay 2.5 okay sorry okay i take trade 2.5 2.5 and then sell so uh because when uh the price is between 95 and above uh, also uh 80 80 so uh, then uh, i can look here and then wait till uh the maximum candles of one minute candle the maximum is uh, only five okay I can only wait till five but I always like to take only three or four I like to take three only I take three candles then I close then I take three candles I close why 
because I am going to minimize my losses. I don't want it lose. So if I take two or three candles per day, like this amount, for example, I take 2.5 or 3.5 US dollar, then I close. Then I close. Like this time, I'm not also losing more. I'm not losing. Spikes cannot happen when I always enter the proper time. When the price is between uh, 95 and also 80, then I blaze and then wait till uh, 5 candles. The maximum is 5 candles, but I always like to take only 3 candles in order to maximize my losses. So, uh, to minimize my losses, sorry. So, if like that way, uh, if the Ekemoji is above uh, level, also 80 and also between uh, also below 95 that means it's between 80 and also 95 so 95 and 80 so then i blaze and wait till three candles let me see so i only have one two and then i wait till it reaches three then i close five dollar or three dollars and then always think about how you can reduce the lot size like this time i'm going to uh, reduce the lot size i close and then say i'm going to take 1.5 okay 1.5 i'm going to close 1.5 profit which is 2.2 then then you see i have only one one then uh, i can wait till another or i can close it too so no problem how loss is it's all about this account is not the real because i'm going to show you uh for uh, how this strategy works only then when when i close when i take the okay now the entry and the second uh, i will close when this candle closes that is the three candles which i always like to take and minimize my losses so this is how it works in uh boom so how does it work in crash so it's simple uh, go in uh, crash and then find that the price is in between uh, 15 and also uh, 5 so when the price is between f below 15 and above 5 then you can take uh, trade and buy till 5 candles the maximum is 5 candles no matter how strong it moves up wait only that because if you can get too many times in a day because in every day how many chances do you get here you get man too many times too many times how many times do you get here you get here you get here you get here so so you are not also thinking about a big profits because when you think a big profits then you lose then you lose in a spikes because spikes can also uh, uh, balloon your account. So, okay. You wanted to take a profit, then and minimize your losses. You can also uh, uh, follow the way I am doing. For this, like this time, we cannot take buy in crashes. Let let us look another crash, which is. Uh, 500 index also we miss it the entry we miss it the entry we cannot made a, a, a buy we also we can all only make a buy when the price is between level 15 and above level 5 so when it is in or between both these levels then you can buy if you buy here then you can wait till five candles you can wait till five candles and then you close in order to minimize your losses. So this is the simplest way or the way that you can buy a uh, crash and sell boom. So I hope you got this and everything is now clear if you follow it. I hope you like this strategy and uh, make sure you, you uh, also... Uh, practice in demo first but before you uh, go on a live account please this strategy works and try to collect your small profits not big profits try to collect it ten dollar five dollar three dollars 
then if you can if you collect it more than 20 times in a uh, maybe uh, uh, one dollar in each time one dollar so it's twenty dollar per day and you make a huge money all the time thank you guys and try to follow this strategy it's so simple